Hey guys, it's Larry Greenberg, and today we're going to take a look at the Sketch Custom Jacket for the new iPad. This case sells for $39.99, and it comes in two color variations. You can choose some either tan or black. So let's crack open the Sketch Custom Jacket and see what this case is all about right now. So this features a kind of plastic packaging that has a Ziploc style closure at the bottom. You slide it open to pull the case out. Nothing uh, else in here other than some brief literature about the custom jacket itself. This is a super thin case. It's quickly become my case of choice for the new iPad because essentially it does everything that I want a case for the iPad to do. Not only does it work with the sleeper function of the iPad, but it also allows you to prop up your iPad into two different stand orientations and it does it quite nicely. It also remains super thin and super slim, which is something I also look for in an iPad case. So let me just give you kind of a quick look. It's like a hard shell. Um, I'm gonna call it like pleather. It feels sort of like leather, which it's not, but it has the look and feel of leather. As I flip it open, I'll remove the foam insert. It features, again, like a hard shell, snap on the back style back that you put the iPad into, and then it all just kind of works. Let me uh, flip this open and snap my iPad inside here. Here is my iPad. Really doesn't matter which way you do it. You just kind of click it all into place like so. Once it's in there, nice level of protection that it offers you, again, while remaining really slim while using it. You can see the crease in the front. That's what's going to allow us to prop this up into two different stand orientations. The Sketch logo is there on the front embossed, but it's very subtle, which I like. On the back, there is a notch reminiscent of the original iPad case from Apple, and that's what we're gonna tuck the front flap into when we wanna prop this up into a stand mode. Let's take a look at all the ports first. On the bottom, you've got a nice size cutout for the speaker. No like perforated cutout. This is one large cutout, which is going to give you the best access to the speaker. Of course, cutout for the 30 pin connector so you can plug in your cable. One large cutout here on the side as well for the volume rocker and the mute slash orientation switch. Across the top, it's completely open. So you have access to the sleep awake, the mic and the headset jack and then a really nice, perfectly lined cutout for your rear-facing camera. Now, as I mentioned, this does work with the sleep awake function of your iPad. So when you close uh, the case, your iPad will go to sleep. When you open it, it will wake up. When it comes time to prop this into a stand, you simply take the front flap and tuck it into this little notch like so, and then you're able to stand this up into two different stand orientations. This would be like your video stand for watching movies and other you know, videos on the iPad. And then you have what I like to call the ergonomic typing stand, where you once again prop it into the flap on the back like so, and then you can lock it into this position for a nice ergonomic feel. Now, because this case is so stiff, it really locks into that groove quite nicely. A couple of the other cases of this type that I've tried, once you get it locked into either of these two stand positions, they seem to want to flap around and flop over because the front cover isn't all that rigid. That is not the case with this one. It's nice and stiff and really does stay in place when you have it in either of the two stand orientations. So that has been a brief look at the all new Sketch Custom Jacket for the new iPad available for $39.99. This is on sale in the US from amazon.com right now. I'll put links in the video description directly to the product page on the Sketch website where you can find more about it. And then also to the Amazon page where you can order it if you so choose. Again, it's available for $39.99 in your choice of either black as you see here or tan as well. As always, if you have any questions about the product you saw here today, please feel free to drop me a line. Otherwise, you have a great day. Please be sure to check out my two latest videos. Please like this video, leave a comment below, and of course, subscribe to the channel for more content.